This unit is equipped with a suburban water heater. As you can see, there's a drain plug in the center here. And if you take that out, attached to it's actually an anode rod. Uh, this does deteriorate over time, um, so you're going to want to replace it once it gets 90% gone. Um, the reason they put these anode rods in there is so that the minerals in the water don't eat the tank. It actually de degrades this uh, anode rod. So the plug just goes in there like that. And if you look to the left here, if we can get a good shot of it, there's a switch. This is off and on. That's an electric switch um, for your water heater on electric. There's a switch out here that has to be turned on. There's also a switch inside that we'll show you when we get in there. So there's two switches that have to be turned on for this to run off electric. The switch for gas is inside and there's only one switch. Um, up here is the pressure relief valve. Um, if the pressure gets too great in this water heater, it'll actually pop this valve open and it'll drain out the top. It is pretty normal for this to weep one drip every 30 seconds or so. Um, any more than that, you might have a leaky valve. These two buttons here are your um, resets for your 12 volt side. If you ever have any problems with your water heater, you can go ahead and try to push these in. It may solve the problem. If not, give us a call. Now one thing you're going to want to remember is when you hook up your water and turn the water on, it's going to fill your water heater. And as it's doing that, it's actually going to half fill full of water and half full of air. So to vent that air out of there, you're going to want to step aside and hold this pressure relief valve open and air and water is going to spray out of there. As soon as water starts coming out of the pressure relief valve, you know it's completely full. And then you can go ahead, if you choose to run it on electric, you can turn both switches on. Make sure the water heater is full of water before you turn it on electric because you can burn up the heating element.